Hey Scorpio, my name is Crystal. I'm doing a reading for you guys. I don't know what it's about. We're just going to pull the cards and see. Um, I have a couple Oracle decks. I'm going to pull some from each and then I'm going to pull some Tarot. We're going to see what we get. Alright, we have the Star, the Page of Cups, the Seven of Cups, the Fool. Okay, I feel like you are having some type of hope within this new um, love situation, this new offer that you're about to get or, or wanting to get or just got. Alright, there's a new offer of love, a new career, new something, new sparks, new inspiration, something new, and you have a lot of hope for this, right? Um, but you're a little confused right now at the moment because you may have multiple choices. You might have a lot more um, options than um, just one, right? So it's leaving you confused, but the fool tells me you are about to go on a new journey. You're about to take a new leap of faith, right? Something new that what you never... Something new, okay? Um, let's see. Serendipity is going to bring you happiness. Happiness. The fates. This is fated. Okay, so the universe planned all this. A leg up. Uh, uh, they plan everything, let me say. A leg up. Um, and by the book. I feel like you're taking the steps that you need to take in order to get to where you want to be. Like I said, this could be a career. It could be a new love that's coming in. But you do. You are like... Um, the star is also like a wish fulfillment card, I think, you know what I mean? So I feel like you are about to get your wishes, and if it's about this new love, this new start, this new career, whatever it is, I feel like it's going to it's gonna work out for you, but there is more things that you're going to have to choose from um, that's going to leave you, uh, that you're confused over. You have more than one option, so you're really, really um, confused at the moment. You don't want to make the wrong choice. Come on, dog. Yeah. Thanks. All right, you have gates of triumph. Success expands in your life. Far away places. Get ready for new horizons. Maybe you're moving. Um, it could be to start a new job. Maybe you're moving in with a partner. Maybe this is the offer that it was. Okay, maybe you're like freshly moving in with somebody. Maybe you're moving away from somebody. You have navigating by the stars. Follow your bliss. So I feel like that's what you're doing right now. Serendipity. You're going for your happiness, okay? You're going for your happiness. With the leg up, you might have to ask some help for some help from people. I feel like by the book you are doing what you need to do in order to get to where you need to be. You are taking the steps, right? <clears throat> the star card also tells me about balance. You're trying to balance the situation out. You have ascending the mountain, keep on going forward, which means you are making progress, you are moving up. Even if you feel like you're not moving up, you are and the universe sees it. And by us keep on moving forward and never giving up, the universe usually grants us, you know, or gives us like, you know, some type of like thing in return for being successful and never giving up. So it's like a little gift from the universe. Conclusions are within reach. The end of a tough cycle approaches. Okay, so maybe you're hoping for a new start. That's what the star is in the Page of Cups. You're hoping for this new start that you have in mind. You have something in mind. You already have an idea about it. And it's like, this is why you're confused right now. Maybe you're not sure if you should go or stay or whatever. It's like, but the end of a tough cycle approaches and conclusions are within reach. So something is about to end and then you're having a whole new journey that's coming up whoop, for you. <laughs> you got blessings. Okay, this says, amazing news is coming in for you. Your guidance spirit have been working to help you make your dreams come true. Blessings are coming in unexpected ways. Be alert and open to new opportunities. All the good you have put into the world has come back to you. To reward you for your good effort and intent. I just said this, and this is a good omen. The Page of Cups is also a messenger card. So you're about to get some type of message that's going to make you really happy. It could be a message, it could be an offer, it could be whatever. Battle armor. This is an omen to signify the importance of protecting yourself. It is time to raise a shield and ground your energy so that you can be in balance during any tense situation. Be mindful not to put up a wall so big that others who have good intentions cannot get close to you. Protect yourself, but don't isolate yourself with mistrust. So, and always listen to your intuition. That'll help you a lot, too. If you feel off about a person, there's a reason for that. Keep that there. Then you have enigma. Mystery is pre is present. Information and signs are coming in code. This is also an omen about yourself or people in your sphere who are being secretive, hard to read, or cryptic. Seven of Cups. That might be another reason why you're confused, because you can't figure the person out. Some, some things aren't... Are, 
No, some things just aren't ready to be revealed. You are in pursuit of knowledge that must be earned or people are keeping things from you. Explore more. I feel like you're ready to just go on a new uh, adventure. You're not even trying to figure this out. I feel like you're not even want wanting to know. You're just ready to go. Yeah, honesty on the bottom of the deck, right? Somebody isn't being honest here. Somebody's definitely not being honest. So I'm not going to take that. And it doesn't have to be a love that isn't being honest. It could be friends. It could be family. It could be people at your job. It could be your boss. It could be coworkers. Anything. All right? Somebody is not giving you all the information that you need to know. You have a trap. You're definitely feeling trapped in some type of situation, okay? You're feeling like you're stuck and you don't know which way to go. But just listen. Like, you definitely have... This thing is ending. Whatever this hard situation is, whatever this, like sneaky people situation is it's about to go there is endings like back to back especially with the moon card invisible this person makes you feel like you're not important you feel like you're unseen right you feel like you're invisible like you're a ghost right you might as well be a ghost because like they don't even see you you'd be in the same room and it's like nothing you know is happening then you have choices there's definitely a choice that needs to be made okay a message on the bottom of the deck something that you do not see that's coming in there is a new message coming in for you that's going to bring you good news it also may give you an eye opener, right? And help you to realize uh, really what step to go and, you know, in what direction to go. On the bottom of the deck, I felt like looking at the Nine of Cups. Your wish is about to be granted, okay? This, this, these tough cycles are about to be over for you. That's what I got, okay? So thank you so much for watching and take care and I wish you the best. Toodles!